What is up guys, Yugi Now Now here with Matthew and he's going to be showing you his extra deck Monarchs. Yeah. Team Bro Pair! So uh, extra deck Monarchs, basically you want to have as high of healing as possible. So we try and do stuff. Uh, for the regular Monarchs, uh, 3 Aether, 2 Erebus. Uh, you just don't want to clog, you can recycle it and stuff, so that's good. Uh, 3 Karaz. You just want to go off on your opponent, draw as many cards as you can, turn one, as well as having some in the deck. So you can use it to, uh, uh, to clear your board in the mirror. For the vassals, I just play two, one and one. Um, so one Mithra. One Mithra, yeah. I kind of built the deck on the theory that I'm going to draw perfectly every time. So like, I just resolve this, get this, and then get this out and this out. And yeah, uh, yeah, you're gonna dead draw them sometimes. Like I side the extra Mithra for like uh, the mirror. You need more tributes than your opponent. So there's that. Uh, it works out sometimes, but like you're playing monarchs, like you're, you're gonna break. Um, speaking of bricks, uh, Dark Witch and the double Lazuli for the Brilliant Fusion targets. Um, I cannot play one. Uh, it sucks basically. But like. Um, uh, sending this off really and adding this with return, like turn on your hand, it, it does kind of help unbrick. So it's 50 50. I don't know. It's okay. Uh, the other options, like the speed roids, and those are okay too. Uh, I'm playing the Tzolkin build. So two quick for all, two tuning. Uh, sometimes you'll mill pantheism and like live the dream, make a clear wing, synchro dragon, clear <laughs> crystal wing. That's all right. Uh, I think it's 18 monsters. I don't know. Don't quote me. Um, three brilliant fusion. And then the spells, three, 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 three. Uh, you just want to see this turn one, uh, pop with Karaz and keep going into your extra deck. Uh, one domain, one frost blast. This is kind of techie for locals. Uh, you still need one of these to uh, get the rank six plays going. And then I play a foolish as the last one for one. Um, this is basically an Erebus or an idea or a Lazuli if you want to add Dark Witch for whatever reason. So this is kind of like a high utility card. And then uh, three prime. Yep. Uh, you need three prime because like, uh, you want two in the grave and one on the field. So you want to be able to summon one during your opponent's turn and during your turn. So you make a rank five every turn uh, and also not die. And then the last one you need for the mirror uh, to shuffle back your spells. So you always have more cards than your, your opponent. So that's 40 for the main. Uh, Extras, double. Uh, I have space and like I have the two gym knights, so I can resolve it. So two of those. Uh, to Zulkin stuff. Uh, you just want to like clear. Uh, you just want like basically uh, try and get rid of their back row uh, or like their front row and just go off and like try and game them. Like the two eight and two six is really important for uh, getting like uh, like eight thousand or eighty two. Uh, Shark Fortress go for game. Uh, protect your setup turn one. Like if you open like total nuts, you can do that. Uh, defensive card. I should be playing two of these. This card's nuts. Yeah, that card's really good. Uh, Tyrus, uh, Adrius is also a thing. Like Popper Strick, keep going. This is slower, but like it does play around uh, rivalry with the Dark Witch. Uh, Beat Rice. If you open just totally nuts, you can start like sending stuff. Uh, it doesn't have a whole lot. Usually you go for this. Try and uh, add back your Aether so you can like play during your opponent's turn. Uh, I should have a Guy Charger, but I don't because I'm bad. I think. Uh, so I should have a Guy Charger, again with Volcasaurus, you just want to like kill them, uh, and then the 8, which is whatever. Uh, literally never, like, never summon this, but like in the mirror, you can suck up uh, Stormforth and stuff like that, so it's not bad. Uh, is there anything you change about the deck? Uh, the main deck? Yeah, like I'm still messing with these, like I'm not sure if this is even correct to play, because it takes up like a lot of space in the extra deck. Um, and then, like the Vassal engine always changes, yep. um, depending on like what you need for your meta. Like if, there, if there's more mirror matches, you want more of uh, like the, the little black guy, so you can like get the gives effect off more and like summon more than your opponent can. But like the deck only has two plays per turn, so if you can get that third with like the second Mithra or something, you'll just be like so much further ahead than your opponent. And the side's kind of dumb, like whatever, whatever. Uh, Again, whatever, you just want to be able to play more than your opponent. Mm -hmm. uh, this, this is Clutch in the Mirror. This is probably one of the better cards in the format. Uh, Twin Twister, you just want to push through stuff. Uh, again, for the Mirror, best card. Uh, turn off their domain if they like really rely on it, or their Stormforth, or their returns. Uh, and then, because this deck goes into time a lot, uh, I feel almost obligated to play this. Uh, I just don't want to lose in time. Like, you, you side in the one, you gain 2,800 during like turn five or whatever. They're salty as fuck. And then, uh, 
So like since the deck turbos so much, you're uh, very likely to draw this. Like you can go through like 18 cards turn one. So easily. That's the deck. It's pretty cool. Uh, I think um, if I can play the game, I'll win. But it, it's the games that you can't play where you lose, where you draw like this and this and this and this, <laughs> and you're just like you feel sad as fuck. But um, but the, the deck's nuts. Like if it goes off, you're gonna be able to play and you're gonna be able to win. So it's it's kind of a uh, I don't want to say a dice roll, but it is kind of risky to take like a big event where you're playing eight plus rounds. And, but for locals, uh, I haven't lost a game in like, or a game, yeah, in like two or three weeks here. So it's working out pretty well for me. Kick my ass. Word. <laughs> all right, any shout outs? Uh, shout out to my boy Leo. Uh, he put all these cards together for me. Shout out to the squad, Braden, Zach, Sam the Man, uh, Ryan Bolt. Love you guys. Uh, that's it, man.